Hi and welcome to Cardpresso. In this video tutorial, we'll teach you how to work with several card layouts on the same database. Let's imagine that you have three different departments on your company, but only one database, and you need to distinguish them visually for faster identification. How? Let's see. To start, let's click on the open button on the welcome screen. As you can see, the card template is already there. Now, click on the card template image and click OK. Now, we are on the working screen and have automatically connected to the database. It's time to start working on our card layouts. And to do that, let's click on the layout tab. As you can see, you already have one layout from CardPress Business Card. Now, we have to add two more to have three different layouts for sales, support, and development departments, for example. To start, let's change this layout name to sales, like this. OK, now click on the Auto button Select checkbox to check it. In the Excel row, we choose the field that will define the layout selection. In this case, will be the department field. On the next combo box, we set the condition for the chosen field. On our example, we set it to is equal. And on the text box below, we had a value for the condition, that is in this case, the department's name. Finally, check on the Auto Select checkbox. This option allows you to see the card layout according with the condition field type when scrolling through the database records. Now, we choose our background, that is in our example, what defines the different departments. Click on the Browse Image button, open the image box and choose the image. Right click on the image and set it as a background, like this. It's time to add a new layout for development department. And to do that, let's click on the copy button. As you see, it copied our previous card to the new layout. All we have to do now is the same procedure we made for the sales layout. Change the name, the database settings, for this new layout, and finally, the new background. At last, the support department layout, and the procedure is exactly the same. Click on the copy button, again, change the name. Define database settings for this new layout. And finally, the new background. Like this. Now go to the scroll buttons and start scrolling through the database records. As you can see, now the setup of the card is finished, connected to an Excel database and with three different layouts to define the different departments. But this is an example. You can choose as many layouts you want and define them as you like. Simple, isn't it? Like everything else in CardPress. All you have to do now is save your work by pressing the Save button here. See you on the next tutorial. Thank you for choosing CardPress and goodbye.